Right, welcome back to this seventh episode of the Brighton Hove Albion Career Mode on Fib 16. We're going to start this episode with a match against Rotherham. Let's see how we do. Hi everybody, welcome to you all. Martin Tyler here along with Alan Smith. Uh, Alan's been assessing the conditions. Uh, it's raining. Is that going to help the attackers, do you think? Well, it normally does. Tends to lead to one or two mistakes from defenders. I looked at the forecast beforehand. I don't think this rain's going to let up. It doesn't it? And uh, I hope it's not a dull affair. And here's the shot. Well, he lost his footing at the crucial moment. It seemed that way. It's a slippery old surface down there, and you've got to get your feet sorted out properly. These two have got a great... And here comes the counter-attack. Keeper can collect this one. Attacking well here. Shots on here. on it here well, it's a passing game and my word they're passing it well here and well, he's kept the cross low oh, well done the goalkeeper and he's hung on to the ball Quite a good enough shot. He's crossed it well. That's an easy interception because the pass wasn't really a very thoughtful one. It's over and the referee blows the whistle for the last time. So there we go. A nice 1 0 win against Rotherham. Gabriel Jesus scoring that nice clinical finish from halfway. So, some training. And. Oh, Dominic's gone up to 70. Yep, he's gone up to 70. And messages. So, the scout has returned with the world class youth player. Let's take a look at him. Fabian, the right sided midfielder. He's 61 at the minute, potential 72 to 92. It's pretty good. He's gonna, hopefully he'll fit in well. The next game's going to be against Brentford. And unfortunately, for some reason, the recording didn't work very well. So it was a 2-2 draw away. It's pretty good. So, Hull City next. Hi there again, everybody. I'm Martin Tyler, and Alan Smith's with me for this Championship game. Yeah, I'm oh, Martin. Really pleased to be here. And this match today is Brighton and Hove Albion against Hull City. That is Davis starts, despite looking shaky in recent games. So a couple of strikers for them. Shots on here. And the goalkeeper plunged to make the save. It's a corner for Hull. Routine for the keeper. David Myler. Zamora. Chance from the pass. And now the shot. And it's in the net for the goal. You talk about placing it. He knew exactly what he wanted to do with it. And here's the goal again. Shoots! Oh, he's off target. And that really was a big moment. The equaliser was beckoning. Now Sidwell. Space to try and hit it now. Zamora. That's a very good goal. Very nice. 
Nicely placed, Alan. Beautifully done. Yeah, he's almost passed it into the net. Jimmy Greaves like there, wasn't he? To Robertson. And now the shot. Very good stop here. Here comes the cross. They put that cross far too close to the goalkeeper. That's good support play from his teammates. Here's an opportunity, maybe. Hernandez! What a fine save. And here's the shot. He's kept it out. Well, if this ends up being a win for this goalkeeper's team, he'll be the hero because he's been most responsible for the saves he's made. And in goes the cross. The shot's on. Over the bar and the chance is gone. Abel Hernandez, and it will go into the middle now. And there's the goal! It was a good chance, but against this goalkeeper, you sometimes wonder whether they're ever going to score. They have done now. Yeah, you can't be expected to, to keep on stopping them if you keep on offering up chances. So there we go. 2-1 against the former Premier League team. Not too bad. Probably could have done better, but next game is going to be Nottingham Forest. Hi there everyone, Martin Tyler along with you today, Alan Smith's alongside me, and we've got a game from the League Championship, Alan. Yeah, hi Martin, really delighted to be here. Nottingham Forest in our featured match today against Brighton and Hove Albion. Trying to jostle the opponent off his stride. He's got that through clever reading of the game. The shot's on! A decent effort, just, just off target. Yeah, unlucky because uh, he got some power behind the ball, just not the direction. Look at the coaching manual. You don't. He can hit it here, and it's in for the goal. And he took a glance up there, you know, and he saw the keeper's positioning. Really good, cool, composed finishing. Brilliant football from this team. Gardner. Well, we've got the corner here, and they're desperate to get a goal from it to get on level terms. Superb work to reach that great technique and great belief, Martin, but there's something special about a defender showing those kind of defensive instincts. That's a serious situation, and on he goes. And that levels it up, it's a goal! the old postage stamp in the top right hand corner with that header wonderful to it. this might be it it's a great moment they've scored here and they're into the lead well, the keeper's clawing away to his left but He's hit it really hard, the goal scorer there, first time. Let's see the replay now. Substitution on the field. Off we Keeper's got no chance because he's hit it so hard to his right. Right, so 2 2 in the end. It was a good game from Nottingham Forest. They kept holding on till the end with that second goal. But on to training. Make sure they're B, C's, and D's. No one going up a level yet, but they're getting close. Sheffield Wednesday will be our next game. Hello, everybody. Martin Tyler is my name. Alan Smith is his name alongside me. And we're hoping to bring you some fine action from this game today. And this match today is Brighton and Hove Albion against Sheffield Wednesday. 
chooses to punch here, the goalkeeper. Good technique. Shot on. Oh, saved by the goalkeeper at full stretch. Another corner. Oh, this is great teamwork. The way they're knocking the ball around. What a fine save. Moving forward with some danger to the opposition, now they're here. Comes out, it could be a chance! What a goal! A goal of uh, top class, really, here. Well, the keeper, quite rightly, is disgusted with his defenders because they've just not helped him out there. Let's see the replay now. Shots on here. Good try. Uh, trying to help the team in this situation. They're encouraged by the lead, but they're fearful, perhaps, that this team might lose it. Well, they won't want to give anything silly away. The opposition are chasing the ball, trying to get it back and trying to get back. And here's the shot, and it's in for the goal. Hit it with power, has he? But he's certainly hit it with accuracy. Good luck here again by the replay of the goal. Turner. They've linked up well. Opportunity now. It's the crossbar. Super goal. Well, he's hit it hard and he's hit it first time, but perhaps the keeper could have got more on that. Well, they've been treated to some really good football, haven't they? Some good goals and... Uh, this At full extension, the goalkeeper makes the save. It's a corner now, and they're almost there. So another 2-1, Capitano scoring the second goal, making the win. Oh, World Tournament has gone up to 69, we... <laughs> He's getting up nicely, hopefully he'll be able to be the first team soon, depending on how, if Stockdale stays next season. Sorry, messages. Calderon basically wants to leave us next season, that's fine with me. Don't really want him in our team. And next time, we'll kick off with Fulham. The night lay waste all we give in. But honestly.